skyrocketing U.S. debt can't be supported by dollar printing forever, crisis may be coming. Living with ever-growing debt, which has passed $21 trillion, has become a trademark of the U.S. economy. RT asked an analyst how long this can continue without serious problems for the world's largest economy. U.S. Treasuries and U.S. foreign debt have long been supported by the dollar printing machine, and this support may be ending according to tally trade bell analyst Mikhail Grachev. From 2009 to 2014, the Fed was actively buying treasuries as part of a quantitative easing policy. After the was scrapped, the Fed continued to purchase the securities, only in smaller quantities. American legal entities and individuals have always been the third major buyer of debt. The growth of debt and the volume of issuance of securities was possible due to the continuous flow of liquidity from the Fed at zero interest rate. It has also supported the unrestrained growth of the American stock market, Grotchev told Darty. The tides have changed after the Fed began raising the interest rate, 1.75% currently which is expected to increase to 3.75% by 2020, the analyst notes. The investors' interest in treasuries began to decline and the yield automatically went up. This week, 10-year securities showed a yield of 3.018%. This factor led to nervousness in the markets and raised a lot of questions, Grotchev says a dot with the rising interest rate and treasuries' yields, the question of servicing the mounting debt could become a problem for the U.S. economy the analyst warns. Although the economy of the U.S. is great, even they don't always have the extra money. When the yields on the 10-year U.S. Treasury notarize, it indicates that the demand for the American securities falls, Grotchev explains. The yields rose to a maximum of 15 percent during the peak of the second bear bond market in 1981. Since then, the U.S. economy entered the greatest bull bond market as yields tumbled from 15% to 1.5% in 2016. Following that, the yields have been on the rise again, surging to their highest level since the Great Recession of 2008. If the yield continues to grow, it can lead to a massive exodus of capital from treasuries, and even result in the collapse of the world dollar financial system, Grotchev said. The analyst adds that a dollar collapse seems far-fetched at the moment since the global economy is very dependent on the greenback. According to the expert, it is more likely that the dollar bubble will continue growing for the while.